Hey, how you doing? Would you like a cold water? Thank you. Just bless you. Yeah. Come back one more time. Um, what's his name? Puerto Rico. How you doing, man? Would you like a cold water? They're about to feed at 12. Yeah, lunchtime's coming real quick. That's why I'm here. I'm looking for a friend of mine. Um, hey, man, I got some flavored... Uh, I want one. Yeah, this is watermelon. Watermelon or black cherry? Uh, either one. Thank you. Black cherry. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'll swap you. Hey. How you doing, man? I'm doing all right. Yeah? You ready to get your feast on? Yeah. I hear you. All right. Did you find Eddie? No, not yet. Eddie? Oh, Joey. Yeah. All right. I didn't recognize you there. Uh, no, I've been looking. Um, hey, did a guy named uh, Malik find you yesterday? He's uh, he just got out of jail. He's from Texas, and yeah. I told I told him to look for you. Yeah, yeah, I talked to him. Okay, he was hanging out at the Dollar General for a little bit. All right, you doing all right, man? Yeah. How's that comfortable mattress you got there? Uh, very comfortable. <laughs> I believe it. I guess it'd be better maybe than underneath the bridge sometimes. All right, I'm gonna run over to Greater Works, and but if you see Eddie. I'll tell him to come yeah, I got something for him, like I was saying. Yeah, but uh, yeah, absolutely. All right, good to see you, man. You're doing all right. Yeah, I'm doing all right. All right. Well, I'll let you wake up and clear the cobwebs. I know that's what happens when I wake up. I go like, where am I? You know, it takes me a minute, adjust to the light, the whole deal. Figure out how to stand again. Yeah. All right, Joey. I'll talk to you soon, buddy. All right, all right good to see you. Good. You bet. Didn't even recognize that guy. Well, it's hard when they basically got a blanket pulled over their head and they're, you know, crashed out on their sort of horizontal on concrete. Sounds like a plan to me. Nothing says comfort than concrete. All right, the quest continues. If I'm not mistaken, ladies and gentlemen, if I'm not mistaken, I think this might be Mr. Eddie. Oh, this is going to be wonderful. There's a whole pile of people. All right, here we go. What's going on, buddy? You don't feel good? Hey, I'm going to pull around and talk to you. I got something for you. Yeah, you're sweating both, buddy. Where's your cooling rag? Okay. All right. Oh, no. He looks physically distraught. I'm going to have to go. He needs to cool off. He's sweating bullets. He's dripping. It's a mess. Eddie! Well, he's he's walking off. What's up with Eddie? I don't know. He's, uh, he's, he's walking away from me. Here, here, yeah. Matter of fact, hold on. Let me set you up. I got a little five pack for you. Uh, right. What was your name, buddy? Cody. Cody. I'll show you. I'll talk to you. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's been a while. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. You look familiar. You got the sun thing going on. Yeah. You need some sunscreen, buddy? No, I'm good. I'm no? Well, yeah, let me get some. I'm not good. All right. I'll, I'll set you up. Well, here's a pack of... That's a five pack. Okay. Cigars? Yeah. Yeah, here. I'm, I'm, I'm good on cigars, bro. I, I, I can't... Yeah. I, thank you, though. You know? Yep. Well, I don't do the cigarettes, per se. Yeah, too costly. Uh, hey, yeah. Uh, uh, toothbrush? Yeah. Some toothpaste? Yeah. Uh, any kind of soap? Yeah, think? I got soap. Um, I'm trying to think. Deodorant? You got that, too? Deodorant? Here you go, man. Uh, you got room in your bag? Yeah. Soap and deodorant? Yeah. For Mr. Cody? Yeah, man. You got a water? Yeah. You, you guys just had lunch, didn't you? I, 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 that's where I'm about to go. I'm sorry? That's where I'm about to go over and get something to eat. Oh, well, you better get there before they close. Uh, I'm, I mean, I hope they're yeah. close. All right. You got a fat fat bag of chips in there. Yeah, I, I, I got it from the ministry over there. They have them sitting out. Cool. Thank you, sir. All right. Have a good one. All right. We'll see you, man. How you doing, buddy? Are you staying over here? Yes, sir. Yeah? It's like, 
Did Where's you have a good lunch? Is that a camera? Yeah. It's it's for my YouTube. Okay. Yeah, we have met before. Let me just give you a card. You can ask anybody around. You know, okay. I don't. I'm, I'm not here to cause any trouble. You want to start doing flips or what? Like, if you want, can you do flips? You look pretty athletic. No, I can barely walk right now. <laughs> JP, come and holler at me when, it, when you get that. <laughs> All right, man. Have a good one. You know, Eddie looked out of sorts there. I'm gonna see if anything, if anybody knows anything about it. Hey, Joey. Do you know anything about what's going on with Eddie? He was just here. Yeah, but uh, he was leaned over, sweating bullets. And I wanted to talk to him, and then when I, by the time I parked, he was hightailing it down. Wow, that scared me. He was hightailing it down the road. I don't know, I just woke up. All right, you better get in there, man, get some lunch. That's already done, that's fine. Huh? Well, at least cool off. Yeah. All right, buddy. Well, that's all right. You know, I'll see him. Man, that's that's bad news. Yeah, he didn't look so well. Hey, buddy, do you know Eddie? Do you know Eddie? No. Spanish Eddie? No. How you doing today, buddy? You ain't got extra cigarette, do you? Yeah, well, I got some uh, cigar-style cigarettes. Cigar? That's yeah. all right. All right. Well, let's try it over here. You Can I add? Right? I'm doing great. Can I ask your name? Stanley. Stanley? My name is Daryl. Daryl. Nice to meet you. Here's what I do, man. Uh, do? I, don't, I don't think we've met before. No, sir. But uh, now I got some smokes for you. You got a lighter? Yes, sir. Up in my town. Okay. Are you underneath the bridge? Yes, sir. All right. Yeah, I know lots of people, you know, through here. I've been doing this for, you know, a little bit in this area, but uh, I haven't seen you before. So. No, I ain't. I've been here about a month. Yeah? Where from? Cleveland. Tennessee? Yeah. Okay. Is it pretty rough up there? Yeah, it is. Yeah? Yeah. All right. I got you. Let me hook you up. All right. Did you eat? You get a lunch? Yes, sir. All right, good deal. Yes, sir. Good deal. Good deal. Can I get one of them lighters too? Oh, yeah. No, 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 not a problem. <laughs> I closed my trunk on accident. I'm sorry, I don't hear you. That one I got's about out. Oh, okay. If you don't hear it. No. I appreciate it. Oh. Uh -oh. No, that's why I'm here, man. Thank you. So, yeah. Now, uh, one of them guys probably know him. I just been around. Oh no, here. I've known him for a while. Oh. But he was over here just sitting and he appeared to be sick. I pulled up and he was leaning over. He was sweating bullets. Huh. Dropping sweat. So I was worried about him. And I got a gift for him. Yeah. You know. Yeah, I just been around about a month, so I don't know a lot of people. Right? Yeah. What brought you out to the street, my man? I got out of prison. I just got out of prison. Really? Yeah. Okay. Um, so, you're, are you a, on like parole or probation? Boat? Well, parole. Yeah. That's even worse. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I thank you, though, again. No, you're welcome, man. I appreciate man. it. All right. Well, I wish you the best of luck. Have a great day, man. Thank you a lot. Hey, don't be afraid to walk up to me when you see me. Um, you know, I, I travel this area quite a bit. You know? Okay. Yeah, it's the first time I've seen you out here. Yeah. Well, it's, it's every, you know, couple times, three times a week or so. I, you know, I make my, you know, I travel, you know, throughout the area. Okay. You know, I know lots of people in the area. So, all right. All right. Thank you. Good deal. Do you need any, do you need anything else like soap or hygiene items? I, I just got some this morning down in uh, Greater Word. Yeah? They give me deodorant and stuff. Nice. Yeah. Good deal. What about socks? I got some. Okay, fantastic. I try not to get it. If I got it, I try not to get it. Yeah, it's a lot, lot next, scary. The next yeah. person might not have it, you know? Yeah, if you take something you already have, somebody else might not get any. That's right. No, I know that story. <laughs> Believe me. A lot of them take it just to get it, you know? Yeah, just to have it. It's like, whether they use it or not, it's, it's street. 
yeah. currency, you know, <laughs> trade bait, so to speak. Yeah. All right, good to see you, man. Hey, you too, man. All right, be careful, please. Be careful, All right. Fresh out of prison. Been here a month. I've been here many times. You know, it's all about timing. All right, guys, I want you to look at something off in the distance here. There's this black, looks like a Honda Civic Accord. It's sitting there, and the, every window is open, and it's in the furthest most parking space away from, from the Walmart entrance. All right, that tells me that somebody's broke down out of gas or they are homeless and they are living in this parking lot but i'm gonna go i'm gonna drive around to get up to the main parking lot and i'm gonna go see what's going on there might not be anybody in it but every window's down and uh that's just sad especially on these hot days you know we're uh we're getting into prime time heat here in georgia you know it's a mess all right i'm gonna be back Alright guys, we were just talking about that black Honda. Well, here's the deal. The driver's door is open. But there appears to be nobody in it. And it's kind of got accidental, you know, it's got damage on the front, the right front. You know, a few different spots. Alright, well I'm just going to park and make an approach and see what's up. After further examination, this car is multicolor. Man, that's sad. Good car. You know, I wonder if it's just been abandoned or. Oh, no, there's somebody in there. Oh, he's totally sleeping. Man, this is horrible. Look at this, guys. Hey, buddy. Sir? Wow. I don't know what to do. He's breathing. Hey, buddy. I don't mean to startle you, man. I see you're chilling in your in your car here. Could you use a water? No, I got stuff. Yeah. Man, it's 100 degrees out here. Yeah. Would you like a cooling towel? You wrap around your neck. No, I'm all right. I appreciate it. You're doing all right. Uh, what are you out of gas? No. No. All right. Just taking a nap. Yeah. All right. Cool. Well, I'll tell you what. Let me give you a car, this might change your mind. Here's what I do, man. I help people that are struggling, having a hard time. I got supplies, hygiene stuff, food, drink, whatever you probably may need. Uh, I see you obviously sleeping in your car here in the back end of the parking lot, so you're furthest away from anything. So. Um, I, mean, I appreciate it, man, but I'm good. Yeah? Can I ask your name? Josh. Josh, my name is Daryl. I'll tell you what, man. I got a uh, this is a ten dollar gift card for Walmart here. I appreciate it. Yeah, that's from Dorothy in Texas. So, all right, I didn't I didn't mean to wake you up or disturb your day, but it's like I seen your door wide open, and I didn't know if there was a bunch of people in here or not. You know, that's what I do. So, all right. Well, I guess have a good day. Uh, not yeah, much, not, good, not much more to say. You all right though? Yeah. All right, cool. Well, with that being said, I will leave you alone. <laughs> you like it out here, man. <laughs> all right, have a good one. This must be recent because they would generally be more acceptive, receptive to some help. And uh, 
never seen them before that doesn't that that doesn't mean much you know just because i haven't seen them that's because it, it, this happens continuously it pops up overnight but uh what a deal 100 plus degrees heat index he's sleeping in his car all right well he says he's good so what can i do but um, all right well he's already at the walmart so dorothy's card from texas will will help him out he'll he'll use it that's for sure he'll find something for it gas if you know anything because this is the one that has the the gas station next to it and on the rare occasion that i find homeless people that have a car this would work out pretty good all right i'm gonna shut down i gotta put my seatbelt on